Hey. You there again? Wow, you're still here. Okay. Day five. We did. One team's left. One team just packed up and said, stuff this, we're out of here. Day five, they'd, I think they'd done some engine damage or something, boat. They were using their spare boat in day four. They said, nah, stuff this, we're gone. They packed up and left. They didn't even worry about fishing day five. I ain't never seen anything like that before. The first year we come back, I come back into it in, in, when we started the Tigers. Um, I didn't catch a fish all week, a point scorer, but I've caught little rats. We weren't cat, no one was catching rats. Um, little tiny fish. It was, yeah, it's just, yeah, really, I think the whole, whole, it was all, it had all come down. Uh, the committee had done everything they could. They'd expanded up in, to the upper parts of the daily to try and help us out to get, get us fish but there was more snags up there and dangers to your boat than people it just wasn't worth it because you're only going to get little ones anyway or it's just there was no fish there anyway so um day five was a really somber day um i think halfway through the day we sent a lot of boats that are just i guess you know it's hard not to give up when you're not catching anything 10 hours a day trawling uh still can't feel this finger it was numb from just sitting there on the trawl flicking 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 um done everything possible every team had put in everything i can and guys were breaking um th right near the end of the day we had a drone incident you'll see in the video on that there'll be a video either up here or here we'll try and get a link up there for you to get to our drone video uh the demise of Droney. He uh, he just wasn't going to play the game with us. I don't know what it was since day one. He's struggled with the go on the forward, but you'll see the end of him in this video uh, as well. Uh, we'll try and just I'll just add a short bit on him, but we'll do a full video on on all all the drone action and what happened with him. It's quite funny. So yeah, and that was probably the highlight of day five actually, when us playing around when Droney crashed um, and decided to do his own thing and then crash. So yeah, it was a big struggle for all the teams. Uh, really, really, really tough year. Um, yeah, hard to come back after that. Um, just fingers crossed to get some rain next wet season in the Territory, they definitely need it. That that river, the whole Territory needs rain. It's, it's always torrential ever since I've been a kid. It's been torrential rain every year. They do 15, 1600 mils a year normally um and this year i think they just barely got to like 1100 1200 mils which is just not enough not enough it, that, to keep everything alive it's a very tropical climate so tough day here we go last day and i just want to say a big shout out before we do go to all our amazing sponsors guys 12 months i've been working working my butt off to try and get this to you for 12 months didn't work best laid plans sometimes just never work so yeah um thanks for all your assistance really really appreciate it i uh, hope you'll stay on board with us um for our next adventure where and when that's going to be we don't know um yeah see how we go anyway here's day five barra classic 2019 and you'll see the winners at the end of this video so stay tuned to the end
you're giving me just what I need No time for riddles, you're in the middle In the middle of my self-release You have unchanged Fast roll on this. You saw that shallow one? Turn the fuel on. <laughs> clear. Yeah, clear. Clear prop. Everyone in the plane going, please, man, please. Clear prop. 
<laughs> and then, oh, turbo props. <laughs> Just as the fuel's going in, yeah, the old Bunsen burner lights up. Oh, right over, we're good. I just don't know. Stubby killer? I just don't know why KT is the only one that gets sponsored for fucking cool this one. You got a pocket one? I thought this was a fucking one. Everything he owns has got a sticker on it. How often do you stick it? get in the mail, Joel. Did you get anything to hand? Fucking fit. Fish in the timber? In the timber. Oh, shit. No, fish in, this no fish in this creek. No fish in this creek. The Daly River. The NT's number 61, 61st Barramundi hotspot. I think we could have gone anywhere else in the territory and caught more fish than we have in this river this week. The well, option is we get like a houseboat we at Corroboree for a week and call more on a houseboat, get a houseboat, go there, no rules, for a week. Now let's have the Nightcliff Tigers Fishing Club fish at Barra Classic then. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Get Podgy and, Podgy and all the boys and just go to Corroboree for a houseboat. Ten days. We'll get them in. Good snag. That one. Yeah, yeah. Heading up to Bamboo Corner. I felt my line hit it before my lure hit it. Mate, did he? He's not saying that either. Straight in. Why do you fist on straight line rod pulling? He's through. You're through? Good. <laughs> I overthink that after, <laughs> after 20 days of fishing with us, he still can't ask away from a snag. Please drink it before it gets hot. Sorry, I'm being. No, that's okay, man. I know, I know, I know, I know. I don't know how much you despise hot beer, man. I'm just trying to look after your well being. Your well being is a well being. Oh. Um. <laughs> Sing it, KT. <laughs> Cello. It's going to be a challenge. Challenge? Clear? Yeah. Clear. Clear. That thing's a fucking challenge here, is it? <laughs> it's not really. Getting a drone out of the tree is a challenge. Give me an hour to do, like a 90 centimetre barrel. Give me that. That's a, that's a challenge. A stick standing still is not a challenge, man. What about a drone in the tree, Nick? Look those without even looking, man. What about a drone in a tree? Yeah, I'm fairly good at that. But it takes a bit more effort, though. I can't believe that. Anchor. <laughs> it's recording. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yes. It's recording. Still praying to get some actual fishing footage. Oh, something. You know. <laughs> Fish I've jumping at the back. I've been talking it up for 12 months. <laughs> I've got nothing. We finished six last year. Yeah, talking of wow. Oh, yeah. Coming up on 
problem is we're 26th today. Bamboo. We need one fish to consolidate the top half of the comp. Ooh. Not yet. 40 minutes. It'll come on. Let's have a let us down. <laughs> Maybe that's the trick. I should just give you shit as soon as you. Oh, well, mate, if I'm in the timberage, it means I'm ready to rock. I'm getting stuck in the mud. Sticks, hope you're not out of bed. Now you're lying, man. Same your best for last minute. Pace is good. I'm set up for a big fish. Please, just stick a jack or just through the back on the way tom, past me. Just donk one in the next 40 minutes. Yeah. Just, you know, one that's actually popped up a little bit. Oh, what was that? Pectoral. Beauty. Even the tail. The tail would be sensational. Good sticky edge. Come on the faith! Come on the faith. This is the spot. Come on the faith. Time to shine. I have faith in the faith. Snag. Cockanoes. <laughs> Clear. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, fucking got him on this one. Okay. <laughs> clear? I'm clear. You are? Little branches or something. I barbed it. I went, oh, what's in there? Hang on. Just stay here. Felt it coming and ripped it in. Get off. Ah. Really want to get the same because I know that I just trying to get the stuff out of my mum or me. Huh? No, I'm going to scull the rest of the beer to another one. That'll be just as good as has been like that. Sorry, boys. It's got a big sticky to do it. Timmy? We'd just like to thank Bocker Bearings. Bocker Bearings. I don't know where we'd be without them. I had a little fart in through without Bocker Bearings coming to my rescue. And Blue Tungsten. <laughs> <laughs> I'll cut that in. Che head. Cheers to Ronnie. <laughs> Thanks for fishing in outdoor world.
10 bucks a pop of Xerox, how good. <laughs> yeah, you don't lose back. Should have kept the boxes. <laughs> They were sponsored stubby corners, were they? Yeah, true. They were good, actually. Them, how much did he give them to us for? They were free, though. <laughs> Suckers are good, actually. Suckers are free. They do. Little sucker. Okay, Thanks, right. little sucker. Thanks, little sucker. Did you? Did you? Just a uh, little sucker. Good job. <laughs> I don't know why. Is that not... a wide angle? Yeah, it catches everything. Catches everything. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, right. <laughs> and who's your train sponsor? Yeah, you both. We're all in there. Ashley can train for sponsoring the train. 34 Sacrificial fishing. fishing. Sacrificial train. 34 fishing. 34 fishing. 34 fishing. 34 fishing. Unfortunately, he's there with the drone. <laughs> Do you want to bang through them or? Again, we're back. Again. Thanks to Off Grid Electrical <laughs> installations. Sorry about that. We ran out of battery. <laughs> <laughs> we decided to save the last two for the run home. You'd be, more, you'd be more interested yeah. in going, <laughs> seeing shit on the way home rather than <laughs> the it's fishing more action. Exciting than the fishing. It is heaps more exciting. Than possibility of just slamming into a sandbar, man. <laughs> so should we run through the scoreboard, Nidge? Look at happen when we're Should we run through the scoreboard for the week? Yep. We suck. Other teams don't. Coming How up many do you think are going to be in your zero club? Coming up the club, KT. Oh, now it's my zero club. Oh. You're only as good as your That's last outing. Harsh, mate. <laughs> Too it's only good as the last outing. I'm on the same for all length as you, mate. Okay. 
They used to be cool. Sort of. Not, not during the months of May. <laughs> you got a catfish at least. Slash May. Caddies need loving too. Oh, sorry. What do you get? It's all mud. Coconuts. Thirty minutes to the end of the 2019 Barra Classic. What a year! Fantastic, great fishing all Fantastic. around. Fantastic. Some big fish caught on one hour of one day, and from there on, a bit of case of coconuts or. A nose up there, nose nose. Not a nose or it's definitely a nose. Coco nose. Coco nose. Coco nose. This nag brought to you by Coco nose. Oh. Coco nose drinks. When you really need a nose, but you want a cock. Now, 300 snag for the week. Apparently sponsored by Clear. Clear. He called it. Clear. Up, haven't you? Right. You've gone. I'm going to take you. I'll give myself every chance. Every chance. I'm even going to drill it in the hot rod. I don't want to get the bees. Confidence. With a capital T. I'm not going to get snagged. The barra's going to whack it just before it hits the timber. Tell you what, boys. Legs, legs of a steel cat. Dumping a lot of the bees today, man. Giving it a red hottie? Two more rounds of and then we're forced to go to UDL. Nice, Gary. This week sponsored nice, by Gary. Jesus Water, the water that's holier than now. Oh. Iron so Jack. <laughs> We'd like to thank Iron Jack <laughs> for all the amazing sponsorship of the club. <laughs> But plenty of corn, man. Corn <laughs> means you're healthy, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. That's corn why, corn that's means why, whiskey. That's why I dose up on the corn when they've got it there. Club KT. Club KT. You'll be able to buy all these. One. You'll be able to buy all these GPS locations where there's no fish on same a website. Cock and horse. It's exactly the same stick. I reckon. Hold right next to where it's stuck. <laughs> So if you want these any amazing locations, join our VIP club and get, and get all our data. Kokonos.com. Join us on kokonos.com. Hashtag Niji to bag off. Anos. Hashtag, is that chocolate? <laughs> See? You saw me do it. You thought I was confident. <laughs> Yet again, you were right. Huh? Who's this snag bought by? This snag bought by the IF Baker movement. Bearings. If you need to come see us at Baker Bearings. Think <laughs> pink. <laughs> think pink, think <laughs> IF. Mental health yeah. awareness. We've got more blue you can take a bearing at. <laughs> yeah, right. oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's another snag, oh, thanks to Bocca Berry. Strike back. Strike back. Strike back. Yeah, thanks, strike back. Yeah, now now with the new improved proof float. float. Show them the float. Here's the float, the strike float, back. Yeah. Strike back. When you're building your new ones, can you put some sort of float feature what on here? Doing, um, Do it, man. Thanks, strike back. Another great retrieve. 
<coughs> if any of the putting engineers from Strike Back are watching this, um, a float system might be something that they can Why do you need one, Nidge? Some people drop them in the drink. Name Why? Ashley Kendrays. <laughs> I do need to name names. Bob KT, isn't it? As I said, so we're going to be putting up all our fantastic fishing spots for the Daly River on our website, c34fishing.com. Contact us by email, or you're going to get you all these amazing snags, guaranteed not to catch fish and drop a ton of lures. Unless you have a strike back lure retriever. Fucking <laughs> on! <laughs> and that's another nid oh. snag. Strike back, tackle back. Sticky mat. <laughs> Sticky mat. <laughs> Is that a pad? Wait, can I ask a question? Is that a pad? Ever since the first day that I've seen it on the stage, why is there a pad on the stage? <laughs> I don't know, man. Oh, wow. I saw that the other day. Oh, wow. There's a tire up oh, yeah. on the stage. Oh, Bob, Bob James. Bob James. Yeah, yeah, but. Because that's how they're promotional, that's what they want. Time check? 20 minutes. Got to get past this snag, boys. There's a monster waiting up in the sticks oh, yeah. up there, man. I'm going out sideways this time, huh? Mm -hmm. right. One, one up, Mitch. There you go. That's that. <laughs> Twenty minutes left. That's says official time, four thirty nine, twenty minutes to go. Then the two nineteen Bayer Classic. Hasn't been the year we wanted, but um, it's the year we've got. And I think what you really need to look at is the effect of the science. Greenhouse gases is killing the world. You pretty much come up with what we've experienced this week. <laughs> Buy a Tesla, save the world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Except, except forget about the manufacturing process. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin Rudd 07. Clear. K Rudd 07. I made it through. K Rudd 07. Hey, cock and horse. When in doubt, cock and horse. <laughs> I think the learning lesson for today. Thirsty, eh? like, these beers are tasting good. <laughs> <laughs> and what beers are they, Nitch? I am Jack. Yeah. All right. Jeez, you stick this up, man. I'm a couple of flogging out of you, man. A couple of absolute <laughs> flogging out of you, mate. Yeah. You'll be lucky to walk, right? <laughs> <laughs> the sticking you've got. Hey. <laughs> Come I'm going say we'll turn around and do another run, but there's no way we're going to fit another run in. It's taken us 40 minutes to do this one. <laughs> We could do bamboo back up. I'm so, I, I've got to apologise again, KT. I'm so sorry about your train, <laughs> No, don't worry about the train. Oh, I was so happy when it came out of the tree then. And I, I was from, too, I couldn't believe you got it. I went from absolute jubilation to devastation in like half a second. Up. Yes, got it up. Gone. I think we all thought it was going to float. Well, it floated the other day. Yeah, <laughs> I think that was only the blades. Must the blades <laughs> was the blades. It was Blade saved you. <laughs> SJRC droning. Great drones. Great drones. Just don't go forward. Hence they hit trees. And don't like water. Yeah. So I've told you it'd work, man. See? Electricity. It's not that mysterious, man. Is that a Cockles. lure up there in that shit? No. Oh, it's really it sort of us out early on on day one, but it's really let us down since, isn't it? <laughs> I've got you somewhere, man. I'm oh, feeling you. I'm really feeling you. Probably both in the same snag. Wait, 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 w
And this nag brought to you by a nurse. This is where Team Todd is coming in right? There's no one better than at releasing snags than Team Todd. Snagging was a point scoring event, we would be very interested. Oh. You got another card, mate. There's another one. Nidge, if you were wanting to move into the bush and just go off grid, you know, no power, just tell yourself for sufficient, which is the way of the future, I'd who would live, you look to? I'd live where I live now and I'd go to off grid electric. Installations? They're, mate, they're number one when it comes to In the territory? Going off grid. In the territory. Do you want to go off grid? 80% of the mate, time. Off grid. No power bills, no problems, man. 80% of the time, 100% of the time, <laughs> you've got power. 80% of the time, 100% of the time. Think battery setups are unattainable? These days, mate, the average. Beer? Need beer? Call Nidge. Nidge. Oh. I thought we got past that, man. I thought no. we were back on good terms. <sighs> Nidge. I love you. Love so, you, Nidge. So the total lie, there's... Huh? This is the second last round of beer, Ooh, scary stuff. You know you're near the end of the week of fishing when you run out of beer? We haven't run out of beer, we still have four cards in the tent now. <laughs> We're just not organised enough to ensure that we've got enough beer when we need it. Oh, sorry, yeah. I wonder who does all that. I'm not pushing and blame. <laughs> I'm just saying, we as a group are not organised enough. Let's all that shit out. Still got UDLs for the Trivone. Thanks, Harry. Thanks to the house. Thanks to the prostate check, man. Just give yourself a couple of weeks to recover and then check your prostate. Oh, <laughs> you might be a bit too hard, right? <laughs> Seriously, though, I think I've got mine inflamed. Inflamed, not nose, nose? Enlarged. Enlarged prostate. Enlarged for nose. Oh, nose. Well, at least we didn't. Don't laugh, man. You're only a couple of years behind me. What are you doing for your 50th? Joel, Nidge? he's laughing. He's got a good news up his sleeve. How long to your 50th? What am I this year? What year is it? 19. <laughs> 47 this year. Three years. What are you doing for your 50th? Getting hammered. <laughs> and not inviting you. <laughs> oh, you can come. I, not, mate, see, I don't expect people to travel in a state for shit like that. If we get married, you 
definitely be in there, but you know, for me 50. Yes, I'm gonna get hammered. It's pretty much gonna be everyone I know. I'm gonna do it this night. You can come and get maggoted. But if you live in Perth, I don't expect you to fly to get maggoted. Why don't you do it in Bali? Mate, that is the most sensible thing you've been this week, man. Just buy, just buy, just buy, just give everyone no, two years no, notice. No, 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 I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't do that to my friends and acquaintances. In Darwin? I wouldn't do that. No, that's like, come to me 50 if man, it'll cost you a grand. But it won't to Bali, that's Bali's cheap anywhere in Australia. Oh, it's three, four hundred bucks return. 400 bucks for an airfare. And then you're going to pay about the same for doing whatever you want to do. They're going to do the same to come to Darwin. The only ones that are going to be out are the Darwin people. No, what I might do is, it's in December. Or do a houseboat. What about, what about a banyan farm? Come to banyan. <laughs> we'll catch nothing. No, we'll start at the top section. There's heaps of fish. Why don't we there. reach into a hole and slice our hand open on a broken bottle? No. <laughs> Who was that? reaching into a hole. That was DC Larky. Yeah, that was DC Larky. That's exactly who it was, man. Who? <laughs> DC Larky, man. That is exactly who it was. <laughs> There's no bullshit there, mate. That's him. And what he did, I can, what he did was to to punch the cane to stubby in his hand. <laughs> and problem. Because oh, yeah. all of a sudden, Drew oh, yeah. said, well, we've got to take him to the hospital, man. No, we don't. Snake? Yeah. Nids, can you drive him to the hospital? <laughs> um, no. no, I can't. <laughs> and I'm a bit disturbed that you asked me, Drew. Cool. Okay. <laughs> tries to kill a cane toad with a stubby really like come on man let's be honest you know i still remember that and the blood just pissing out of his hand oh yeah he, he did a fairly serious injury i just didn't understand and why we just was, let him go <laughs> well, i just didn't understand what was my problem and all of it like i know i was responsible one out of the group boy because that is Nids is actually the most responsible one. I'm never going to take the cunt off. Hold on, hold on. Well, I'm in all sorts. Hold on. Still in all sorts. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Just don't put that body here. Well, I'm free of that shit. Now I'm free of that. We're good, brother. We are good. What do we got? Ten minutes? Seven minutes. Are you right? Yep. DC Larky. What a great bloke he was. I'm so glad you were bored. Oh, DC Larky. Much the same, man. There's something really bad has happened, you know? Like, and Jolly, should we go looking for him? So, do you want to? Yep, we're going. Alright. So, me and Joel jump in his U. He's behind the wheel. We drive up Woolliana Road, get sober. to the end. Sober? Oh, yeah, sober. totally sober. <laughs> we wouldn't drive a car. We get up to the end of Woolliana Road. Which way do we go? I don't know. Jolly Chuck. As I remember, it was raining too. It wasn't an easy drive. No. We've turned left onto Daly River Road. Driving along. I don't know. Over the crest of Couple the of hills. Minutes. Here's a set of headlights. Four oh, minutes. do you know it's a dinged up XR6 Turbo U? <laughs> you beauty. <laughs> you beauty, we found you. Yes, for you. Oh, we went to Ulu Crossy. <laughs> of course you what? did. <laughs> yeah, we went all the way to Ulu. Oh, righto, all right. <laughs> well, you're here. Righto, good. You got the food, haven't you? Yeah, 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 I got the food, man. Right, all right, let's go then. Walking back to the car, a certain Joe Harvey turns around to me and says, Midge. I'm in. I'm like, what? You drove me in, man. Yeah, I can't do it on the way back, man. I, I, nah, I nearly come apart on the way here, man. I really need you to drive. And I'm like, I'm oh, waiting. I can't drive. Three minutes. But I've got to, man. All right, no worries yet. Yeah, I'll drive, man. I was following you with one eye closed, man, on the way back. Dude. So next Ooh. time you want to call us catfish, Fish. Next time you want to call, mate, just remember. Two minutes. That out of the whole of Nightcliff Baseball Club two in the minutes. year, what, 2000 and, we'll call it 2002? Mm. We were the only two that can have to come looking for you, man. 
Look, I think what happened from our side, we turned off and we got past Adelaide River. Oh, we River. know what happened. Adelaide we really River. missed the turn off. And no, no, we got to Adelaide River Racecourse and we said, right, we're good to go. Sea Rag said, let's have an issue. And he had one, my navigator and I missed the wrong sign and it was all over. That turned into cold sweats and stress. Because <laughs> we had no <laughs> idea where we were going. And, and then was, two lots of roos. It was lucky, it was lucky Gobbles caught it back up to the 55 centimetres, don't you yes. <laughs> We have his name and details, we can tell him where it is. Uh, there's me, Gibbo and Gobbles in the One minute. Bay going to pull the cherubim pot. Last minute. Me and Gibbo, Gibbo was driving, he was like, out. I was out the front pulling the cherubim pots. And Gobbles out the back flicking. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> it in a fucking barrel like this. What do we do with it? It's up to you. It's your fish. What do you want to do with it, man? <laughs> <laughs> All right, Ed. No worries. Oh, and trust me, when he walks back up the barbie area on the barrel, there was three blokes there. Yeah! <laughs> and as I remember, Leroy come over and goes, Done. That's it? Done. Leroy comes over and goes, <laughs> Thanks, old faithful. Mm. Wow. The toughest barrack classic in oh, history. Five donuts, man. That's a first for me. Very needy. Five. I really don't know what else we could have done. Oh, we awesome. yeah, covered man. every known option, including, uh, including craziness. Official, I'll just cut hey. all these off, eh? Good job, Coconuts. Cheers, boys. Cheers. What are you? Coconuts. Let's cut them all off, did you? You can do that on the way one. Yeah. You're running out of time for you to sort your life out, eh? I was convinced Faith was going to chuck one up for us. Chicken, eh?
make sure everything's in place for this right now. This has been one of the most challenging Barrow Monday classics in recent memory. And so it gives me great pleasure to announce the champion team for the 38th Iron Jack MT Barrow Monday Classic. It just adds to the tension.